Electro Impact is comprised of about four to 500 engineers. We serve aerospace primarily. Our main customers are Boeing, Airbus, Embraer, Bombardier, Northrop, and Spirit. And these customers use our equipment to automate the assembly of aircraft parts. So Electro Impact has a really long history with FANUC. In 2004, we were tasked with figuring out fire replacement. We approached more than one uh, CNC vendor, but FANUC was the one that was uh, most able and willing to meet our needs. At the time, there was no interpolating of outputs with respect to CNC motion, and they allowed us an inroad to actually code that interface in for ourselves. It allowed us to have a really high level part program and allowed us to push the AFP business forward. At the time, a fast AFP machine might have been, say, 400 inches per minute. And today, we now add and cut at 3,000 inch per minute and actual layout, lay down at 6,000 inches per minute. If you look at this AFP head, you can see uh, we have 16 bobbin wound spools. The spools hold a half inch wide piece of carbon fiber tape. And the job is to push that tape out and land it on the part very accurately at extremely high speeds. We need to have very high acceleration machines and that's one place where uh, the FANUC system is kind of fun. The X, Y, and Z axes are 1500 horsepower and that's just, to, just so that we can move the machine quick enough and dynamically enough to get the job done. It's one thing to go fast, but you have to also accelerate really fast. So we accelerate this machine here at over half a G to achieve that a reasonable deceleration distance. And for really short course products like a Springer system, we actually are offering up machines up to 1G acceleration. And you know, we obviously get it done with big FANUC motors. So this is a six degree of freedom machine, has three prismatic axes and three revolute axes. The primary X drive, that's the first axis in the system, is made up of four alpha 500s. The Z drive, we have four ball screws in each of the four corners of this column. That is four alpha 300s. And then we have two Y axis linear motors. We have two alpha 50s for the A axis, smaller FANUC motor for the B axis and then a giant custom torque motor for the C-axis. The C-axis is pretty cool. It can spin 480 degrees a second and accelerates at 1300 degrees per second squared. We don't mess around with uh, power on these machines. Reliability is quite important to our customers. That's our number one concern in the fiber placement industry. We really have had great success in the reliability of the FANUC side of it. It's aerospace, they want the best and we pick the very best components we can. So if you made it onto my machine, it's the best we could find. Uh, we've had great success with their equipment. It's really reliable. And I like working with the engineers in Japan and the local engineers here in America. Without that relationship with FANUC, we probably wouldn't have been able to drag this industry forward.